Yep. Okay. Am I in it? Yep. All right. <clears throat> Is. <clears throat> well, good afternoon, YouTube. That's it. AK Trapper here again with another video. Beautiful day today. We're going to get weather in the 50s today. And I thought I'd do a quick video. I thought it'd be good to make a, a, a fire today. Uh, last one I made, I made with a Arctic strap drill using a mouthpiece. And uh, you can see that if you go back in my videos. Today I just thought I'd do a traditional bow drill. I have a bow made out of a piece of wood here that has a nice bend in it. I like that bend so that I can torsion it up so my uh, my spindle doesn't slip when I'm actually doing the bow drill. And I thought I'd do spruce. I talked to a, an older local man here, an older uh, native man, and he said that um, traditionally they would use spruce. Now, the trouble I have had with spruce before was uh, it chirps a lot. Uh, made, it, made a good coal, but um, it chirped a lot. So using it for a uh, a mouth drill wouldn't be good because it's going to kind of buzz your teeth and that doesn't feel real pleasant. The board I'm going to be using is a, another board. It's an Alaskan style board. Um, it actually has a coal catcher. It has a little shelf out here. The coal um, is made in the hole and then it, it kind of falls out into the uh, onto the shelf. The last one I showed was a, um, a West Coast Alaskan style um, just a little shelf on the end of the board. Your first hole spills out onto the, the shelf. After that hole gets uh, deep and you can't use it anymore, then you make another hole. And the second one, you ca carve a little notch so that the, the ember spills into the, uh, the first hole. And then you just keep working your way on back, making holes. And uh, you can make many, many fires out of one board. And then when it's wore out, you can turn it around and you could actually start on the other side, make a shelf on the other side and, and work your way back. So um, these are Alaskan style boards. I'm going to be using a little, uh, uh, I guess you call it a bearing block, just a piece of wood with a, a penny that I dished. I, I just put that penny on a stump, put a ball peen hammer on top of it and smack it. It puts a nice little dish into it. And then uh, insert the penny into the board, and uh, that'll last a lifetime. Um, nice and slippery, doesn't make any friction here, so it makes making the, the fire a little easier. Today also, we're going to be using some grass to catch the ember, and uh, hopefully uh, get a fire going here, and we can enjoy a nice campfire here. All right, let's see what we can get get going here. The whole trick with a a bow drill is uh, how you hold and steady the 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 drill. You don't want that rocking around, wobbling around a lot. So you put your left foot, if you're right-handed, put your left foot right up there. Uh, put the drill on the notch, and then you kind of rest your wrist right on your ankle or your leg. And here's where I, I can squeeze this to get it tighter. Kathy, maybe you might want to, can you see that all right? Or am I blocking it? Nice long strokes. Produces good material. We're just going to make some material. And then we're going to heat it up. Go a little faster, put some heat on it, and hopefully it'll catch. Let's see if it'll go. Okay, the smoke's still coming off of it. You can see the all the char that we've produced. And the fact that it's still smoking tells me that I've got an ember. So we're just going to go ahead and let that coalesce a little bit and uh, grow a little bit. I don't want to put it on there too quickly because uh, um, it won't be, it could go out if it's not hot enough. But, but you see the, the catcher is built right into the board. And, uh, uh, 
in uh, west coast Alaska and other parts of Alaska, they like to have that catcher right there so that there's no chance of knocking it off into the snow. Basically, it's all self-contained. Okay. Yeah, it's going really good. I'll give you another, another look. All right. Let's see if we can transfer this without putting it out. Make a little pocket here for, uh, with some finer material right there so it doesn't just drop through. And we'll see if we can't get a fire going here. Good transfer, right where we want it. Get up a little closer here so you guys can see what's going on. We got fire already. Okay, time to make it. Are you going? Mm -hmm. All right, that's it. There's a, another Alaskan board design. Little shelf on the side. A little harder to make because you have to uh, whittle this shelf out. This, uh, um, this style is certainly a lot easier and this is my go-to board right there when I'm making a fresh set. So, hope you enjoyed that. Looks like we've got a good fire going and uh, we'll see you on the next one.